Hamptons, the Hamptons. I had to go, uh, had to go bankrupt, yeah, because. <laughs> Jay and I'm here with my July wrap up. I read a total of four books which are all in the exact same series so I guess this is kind of a review of the series as well. I don't know, we'll call it that. So without further ado, let us get started. <sighs> the series slash four books that I read in July are part of the Au Pair series by Melissa De La Cruz. It's I'm going to tell you guys about the Au Pairs, the first book, because I don't want to give any spoilers for the rest of the three books that come in the series. So in the Au Pair series, there are three girls, Eliza, Mara, and Jackie, who are just hired for the summer for the Perry family to be the Au Pairs, which are like nannies, for the four kids that they have. The first girl is Eliza Thompson. She used to be the it girl in the Hamptons until her family went bankrupt and had to move to Buffalo. Obviously when she gets the job as an au pair she is more than happy to return to her rightful spot as queen of the Hamptons. The only problem is that she has to make sure that none of her friends find out that she is actually an au pair and that she's not in the social scene this year. Absolutely love Eliza. She is my favorite out of all of them. She is such a brat and it makes me so happy. <laughs> like I thought it was hilarious like the things that she did and the way that she acted because there was like no reason like girl like you're fine being a nanny like it's not that big of a deal and you're making more money than all the kids partying are. I'm just saying money's big. It's like a super big deal for me because of university. So to be making $10,000 in one summer just to be watching kids, which is basically what I do now, but I definitely do not make $10,000, I would have been more than fine with that. So quit complaining, girl. I'm glad you checked your attitude and fixed yourself before you wrecked yourself, but like, I love you, girl. I love you. This girl is Mara Waters. She is a typical country girl, and she's more than happy to earn some money this year to help pay for her college tuition. And she's clearly only focused on the kids until the oldest son of the Perrys, Ryan, starts to pay attention to her and everything changes. Love was kind of annoying. She was the goody two-shoes, which I don't really relate to. I mean, I am a goody two-shoes, but not like to the point where she was. Like, she was intense goody two-shoes. Like, calm down, girl. Calm down. I didn't like how Eliza and Jackie treated Mara, but they started to be nicer later on in the book, so that was nice. The final girl is Jackie Velasco, who is a Brazilian bombshell in search of her love, Luca, who left her to go back to the Hamptons after his two-week vacation with her in Brazil, and she ends up finding him, but he is not the guy that she thought he was. Yeah, girl, your morals are all wrong, all wrong, just, mm -mm. I liked Jackie and how she developed throughout the book, it was really refreshing to see book was a really awesome summary read, although I think that it was a little bit more for the lower level of YA than what I'm used to now. I liked the book a lot more if I read it when I was like 14, 15 instead of 19, but it was still really cute and I gave it 3 out of 5 stars on Goodreads. In the series is Skinny Dipping and I'm not going to give a synopsis for the rest of the books because I don't want to give anything away, but... Basically, it was really cute, an awesome sequel, and I gave it 3 out of 5 stars on Goodreads. The book in the series is Sunkissed, and I gave it 3 out of 5 stars on Goodreads. It was really cute and fast-paced and an awesome sequel to the sequel. Finally, Crazy Hot. I think this was my favorite in the series. It wrapped up so nicely, and the story was such a good ending to the series. I gave it 3 out of 5 stars on Goodreads. All the books I read in July, I know it was... Not that many, but I did get an entire series done, so I mean, I'm happy about that. I will see you in my next video. Goodbye! In the Velasco? Velasco?